Hey everyone, my name is Olaf and uh, this tutorial will be a beginner Python tutorial in Blender. You will learn how to spawn multiple objects in random locations and as always it will be uh, quick and easy. So uh, let's get started. Okay, so let's start off the tutorial by switching from Blender Render to Cycles Render and then open a new window. Let's delete the default cube, so click X to delete the default cube and then go into the text editor, make a new text and then enable syntax highlighting, which is going to give your code color. Then write in import BPY, which is the module for Blender. And then let's write in from random import randint, which is a random number function, which we need for the random location. And because we're going to add many objects at the same time, we need a for loop. So write in for i in range and then the amount of times you want the for loop to repeat. Let's write in 20 and then a colon at the end. Okay, click enter and then write in bpy.ops.mesh.primitive underscore monkey, which is the object. And then underscore one more time and then add. Then you need to add a parenthesis for the location and then write in location equals and then write a left bracket and write rand int which is the random number function and after the rand int function we need to add some parentheses and within those parentheses we're going to add the um, interval for the location of the random objects so uh, let's make it minus 10 and then comma 10 and these random numbers within the interval are going to be added to the x, y, and set location. So uh, add an apostrophe, then x, y, set, and a new apostrophe, and then close the brackets. Now let's complete this function by adding a parenthesis at the end. Okay, and now we have 20 objects appearing randomly within the interval of minus 10 and 10 on the x, y, and set axis. Let's click run script and as you can see, there are 20 monkeys. Okay, so now that you have the basic code, let's uh, change some values and see what it looks like. So let's change it from monkey to cube. And then let's change the amount from 20 to 30. And then let's click run script. And as you can see, we now have 30 cubes spawned into the uh, viewport. And uh, let's try a cylinder as well. And uh, let's change the uh, interval for the location. So minus 20 to 20. And uh, let's change the amount to, let's say, 40. And uh, if we click Run Script, you will have 40 cylinders in a much wider interval. So that was it for this tutorial. If you want to see more coding tutorials, I might post more. So just uh, leave a comment below if you liked it and uh, subscribe.